Hello guys, welcome to my channel. So in today's video, I will be showing you tips and tricks on how to not get scammed. Without further ado, I guess I will start. By the way guys, you might notice that I'm not using a AI voice, um, I'm actually using my own voice, so I don't usually and um, it kind of makes me nervous. For the first tip, it is playing in a private server, especially when you're just grinding and you're not really doing anything else. You should play in a private server because scammers won't distract you by maybe just going up to you and saying, Hi, I will duplicate your pet or something like that. And I just recommend it if you want to avoid scams. My next tip will be to have your parties and your trades off. So, um, if you go into your settings and, oops, if you go into your settings and then go to interaction, you will see that you have parties and trading. So I like to keep them on friends when I'm not trading. Um, and that way people won't like send me a party or something and say, oh hey, come here to get your dream pet and then I might wanna go, but then I might just get scammed. And same for trading, people could just send you a trade request. So. Um, it's better ju to just have them off or at least have them only on for friends. The next tip is sort of important because um, this is a way people will commonly get scammed and it is seeing somebody else do it and not get scammed. It's basically like a lure. And you will just do it because you see somebody else successfully do it but they are really just tricking you and with a alt account usually they will just pretend to actually do it on an alt account um, so if that was a bit complicated for example I will go and say ABC play pick a door but I will have my alt account say ABC and pretend to be a normal person. And then another person might come. So the alt account will go first and do pick a door and win a great pet. Then the second person will do it, aka you or whoever is being lured will do it and you will probably get scammed. So, um... Definitely don't do it if you see somebody else do it still. This next tip is um, don't trust people even if they give you um, proof on like YouTube or TikTok. They still could scam you. This tip is just so that you are aware that people will just give you proof and it will be convincing enough um so the those two tips were actually ways that people will convince you and you will get scammed this next tip is especially for people who don't already do it um it is to keep updated with new scams the best way to do this is probably on YouTube. You could probably find videos. And also, a YouTuber who often will show you new scams is Kira Plays Adopt Me. There's many people that you could find, but she's just one example. Definitely keep updated with the scams. Okay, this next one might sound a bit weird, but do not trust people you trust even if they have been your friend for a while they could just have been planning on this maybe just to get you to trust them and then 
They will scam you because you trusted them. You thought they were trustworthy, but they were not. My last and final tip is to not friend random people. This one kind of goes with the one I just said, but when you friend people, it almost makes you feel like they are really your friend, even though you just randomly friended them. That way, when they try to scam you, you will trust them. So some people won't scam you, but if you just go onto the servers list and like add people, just add people, um, you might add somebody and they might be a scammer actually, but you have no idea. You just added them and later on, you don't remember why you added them, but you just assume that they're your friend and maybe they'll scam you. So um, it's a possibility, but you never know. And that was it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed. Um, sorry if I got a little confusing or if I kept saying so, um, so, um, like multiple times. It's just, I'm not used to speaking, so it's, uh, kind of harder than it seems, honestly. And anyways, thank you so much for watching. Comment this emoji if you actually got to this part.